Matt Lenehan Boxing Source in association with Freebets.com, Empire Fight Store, Forge, Irish Stout, Kurt Walker, what a performance. We spoke about this prior. You, you, everyone always talks about, you know, you only had that one knockout on your record. He came in there, very game tonight, tough, but you managed to put a stop in his tracks tonight. How pleased are you? Yeah, I'm delighted. Uh, seven weeks in camp. Didn't go home once, came straight back after that last fight in January and worked on a few stuff with hits and it all came out in the fight. I was able to stand, I was able to hit harder and get him out of there. Is that what's changed? You mentioned they're hitting harder. Is that what you've sort of worked on, you know, imposing yourself more on these guys? It was just more about dictating the pace and then once he came out fast, I was able to put a stop to him and then I could do what I wanted. Usually I'm always going back and letting him build momentum and I was able to stop it, so I'm delighted. Did that, did that go as planned for you? You know, it's all good having a game plan coming into it, but when you get in the ring, it can change in you know the blink of an eye. But did everything go... I don't think as it, it went closer to a game plan than what it was. Yeah. It's exactly it. Um, what we're talking about, I couldn't, have, I couldn't have pictured it any better than what it was exactly. You know when you're catching him so clean and you're thinking, what am I going to have to do to actually get him out of there? Because there was points in there where you were sticking and moving, but then you were rolling under him, creating that distance. But you managed to catch him with some beautiful shots. Like, did you think at one point, you know what, this might have to just, this might go go the distance kind of thing? A few times, a few times I near had him and I was pushing it, pushing it, pushing it. I was blowing a bit of a gasket then and I had to take a wee break, but I knew I had three or four rounds there, so I thought yeah. if he's going to get out, I'll take him out slowly. Yeah. But I'm delighted that I got him out. You know what, um, you've picked your moments, you know, live under zone. Conlon Boxing have always put a lot of support behind you, back to you, your ability, your amateur pedigree. How sort of pleased are you that you managed to have this, this breakout performance on the show? Delighted, um, first stop, it's just my first fight in the biggest fight, so you yeah. couldn't ask for any more and puts me in the, in the hat for big fights. Not just that, but a title around your waist or around your shoulder at the minute, gets you some, gets you good rankings and now this propels you into some big fights. Yeah, my name's in the hat now for, for every other fight, so I don't the same fashion as the rest of them, if not better maybe because I was punishing them, but we'll see what's next, I'll take a wee bit of a break. I just want to bring in H. H, come in a second. Um, so obviously, Kurt's mentioned there, it's a career best performance and managed to get him out of there, but you two worked tirelessly on a game plan. I saw you in here before and speaking, <laughs> it's not a bass. <laughs> but no, he was, um, he, he, fought, he fought to plan tonight. Talk me through that and how pleased are you with what he did? Ah, no, massive shout out to Kurt, uh, the whole team, AB, Foz, Sean, Dempo, everyone down at the New Era Boxing Gym. Massive shout out to everyone. Michael Conlon and the whole of Conlon promotion for uh, putting this duo together, man, putting me and Kurt together in the first place. Um, Kurt's not done one trip home, man, in seven weeks, you know what I mean? Um, we always knew, like, seeing glimpses of him inspiring how he can box and how he can perform, and we were just waiting to see that come fight night, are you with me? And Alhamdulillah, I think that we've done justice, we done justice tonight to see that <laughs> come up. I am emotional, man, you know what I mean? It's been, it's been, a, long, it's been a long road, and... Um, and this is the first of many. Like proud of him, very, very, very proud of him. And uh, yeah, we brought it home, baby. This, this was called the breakout, and this was a breakout performance for him. Just, just talk to me. I'll please you that he's got his moment. We talked about it with, with, with other fighters, but he's now had his stage. You know, live on the zone, headlining at Ulster Hall, and you obviously you're a big part of that as well. Uh, no, I'm, I'm proud of him, and uh, I'm, I'm, I'm honoured to work with you. Are you with me? I mean, from the bottom of my heart, bro. Um, He's worth the time, he's worth the effort, he's a lovely person, he has good manners, he's excellent, do you know what I mean? And um, Alhamdulillah, I'm grateful, do you know what I mean? I'm very, very, very grateful. And um, yeah, uh, Beach started faster than what we anticipated. It was we tough, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, we knew it was going to be a fast pace, but not as fast as that. But shout out to Ryan Garner as well, Byron, Rob Caswell, all the guys in the gym that have been giving us some serious rounds of work. Um, Alhamdulillah, man, proud and inshallah, on to the next one. We want one million pounds next, Mick, for the next fight. One million pounds next. <laughs> to the sad. We're ready, we're ready for the next, the big step ups, man. But everything we've done has, has gone to plan. Fuzzy, where you at? Give us a shout. Don't do that, come in. Yeah, boy. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Fuzz. And a big shout out. <laughs> a, a, a big shout out to all the sponsors as well. Um, they, they help support, allow us to put that time into the gym and big up everyone, man. And a new baby. Kurt, last one for your message to the fans. Um, thanks for watching and looking forward to bigger nights. Thank you. Absolutely. Kurt Walker, appreciate your time.